The Kreider Reisner XC-31 or Fairchild XC-31 was an American single-engined monoplane transport aircraft of the 1930s designed and built by Kreider Reisner. It was one of the last fabric-covered aircraft tested by the U.S. Army Air Corps. Designed as an alternative to the emerging twin-engine transports of the time such as the Douglas DC-2, it was evaluated by the Air Corps at Wright Field, Ohio, under the test designation XC-941 but rejected in favor of all metal twin-engine designs. The XC-31 was built with an aluminum alloy framework covered by fabric, and featured strut-braced wing and fully retractable landing gear, with the main gear units mounted on small wing-like stubs and retracting inwards. An additional novel feature was the provision of main cargo doors that were parallel with the ground to facilitate loading. Following evaluation by the USAAC, the XC-31 was transferred to NACA, which used it for icing studies at its Langley Research Center. The Kreider Reisner XC-31 has the following general characteristics. It is designed for one pilot and can carry 15 passengers or 3,500 pounds, 1,600 kilograms, of cargo. The length of this aircraft is 55 feet 5 inches, 16.89 meters. Its wingspan measures 75 feet 0 inches, 22.86 meters. And it stands at a height of 15 feet 10 inches, 4.83 meters. Its wing area covers 802 square feet, 74.5 square meters, and the empty weight is 7,322 pounds, 3,321 kilograms, with a gross weight of 12,750 pounds, 5,783 kilograms. The power plant consists of one Wright R182025 radial engine that generates 750 horsepower, 559 kilowatts. Regarding performance, the maximum speed of the XC-31 is 154 miles per hour, 248 kilometers per hour or 134 knots, and it cruises at a speed of 143 miles per hour, 230 kilometers per hour or 124 knots. The aircraft can travel up to 775 miles, 1,247 kilometers or 673 nautical miles, in range. Its service ceiling reaches an altitude of 15,000 feet, 4,570 meters.